morning everybody I look like a pilgrim like I have like a short bob but my hair is just like being weird it is an hour before I usually wake up for school and that is because I also had to take my sister to school but I saw this little boy had to be like no more than five years old probably on his like way to kindergarten or first grade I don't know he was on his way to class and he had his backpack with his mom and his little sister in her stroller and he was so happy and so excited so that was like my motivation he was so happy oh my god and he was so cute um but I'm making coffee I decided I'm just gonna stay up because why would I go back to sleep for like 30 more minutes of sleep not worth it so I'm making coffee or I made coffee I might make breakfast but didn't really eat yesterday um, so I might make a really big breakfast, which I normally hate. I normally really just hate breakfast um, Because I'm never hungry in the morning, but I'm very hungry right now <laughs> I'm gonna make a bacon egg and cheese sandwich. That sounds so good So I'm just gonna let that cook for a little bit now for a trick this goes with like grilled cheese too if you put your cheese on whatever you're cooking it on you want it to melt put like a lid over it and this one has holes so I'm gonna put effective <laughs> but it'll like get the heat trapped in there and melt it way quicker yeah it's already melty it's literally been 20 seconds the sandwich is so big I literally won't eat until dinner but that was kind of my plan I, I wanted to I wanted a meal big enough that I didn't have to leave campus to go eat again is that really bad I am ready for class now. I have not straightened my hair in the longest time. It feels so weird, but I kind of like it. I don't know why I do it, why I don't do it more often. I am gonna stop at the gas station. I have um, my sandwich that I didn't finish this morning because it was so big. I will eat it probably after I get my nails done. I also have to call and make an appointment. I have a Red Bull. I'm just really prepared for today. I wish it was cold. Maybe I should switch it out. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh my god. Oh my god, I lost you guys for the longest time. Literally all day. I had no idea where I put my camera. I honestly thought I lost it. And then I realized I put it in this little cubby, which I never even open ever. Um, I'm headed to my last class. It's 6.30 on the dot. I'm a little bit late. But I was trying to help Tori figure something out. Something out for a class. I'm crashing. It wasn't going too well, so. I needed to help her with that. And I also grabbed a coffee and they ran out of grande and denti cups. So they put my drink in a Trenti and it is huge. I'm also very stressed. My shoulders are like killing me because I'm never late. I don't like being late for class and I'm late. I've got one minute until I'm late. There's no way I'm like at campus, but oh my God, I'm gonna not make it. Whoa, I'm being blinded by the car behind me. I didn't really vlog anything except for you can't really see but I got my nails done which was a must like seriously I don't even know what I was thinking why I went that long without getting my nails done but it's over and done with we're never gonna talk about it again I'm hungry I went to lunch actually with Tori I didn't end up eating the other half of my breakfast for lunch I went and we both actually got our nails done and then we went to Yard House which just actually opened up on the East Coast. This clip is a mess. What is happening? I'm so red. We went to Yard House. It used to be my favorite place ever in California and they actually opened one up just recently here. Um, so we went there and I got a taco and fries. Their truffle fries are amazing. You need to try them if you haven't and if it's close to you. Um, but yeah, that's all I've really eaten today was like half a sandwich and a taco and some fries. Which I mean actually is kind of a lot, but whatever. I'm gonna go home and probably, I really want noodles, like instant ramen. I'm making food right now and I am so hungry. I'm making literally another breakfast sandwich that I made this morning. I didn't eat it all, so I... I like don't get enough, you know what I mean? Do you just have those foods that you're like, I can eat you all the time. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm making that. I also got this really amazing, lovely package from It Cosmetics. I love them. They are so, so, so nice to me and send me gifts literally whenever. And it's always fun to get them and it's a surprise. So this box, first of all, is beautiful. Look at this. And I'm obsessed with skincare, so I'm very, very excited. I actually already opened this and me and my mom went through it because I was just very excited and she claimed things that she wanted so 
um, yeah, basically it doesn't look as pretty as it did when we first got it, but look, oh my god, just look. I'm so excited. I love, love, love getting stuff from them. So, uh, we have this, which is, I'm keeping this, I'm very excited. It is a bye-bye makeup, basically it's a makeup balm, cleansing balm. Now I'll focus on that. It smells really good, and it's like a solidified makeup remover, basically. So I'm excited about that. This I'm also excited because I don't currently have a makeup or an under eye cream. So this is, it looks first of all so pretty, the Bye Bye Under Eye Eye Cream. And what's next? My mom, I gave this to my mom because I'm pretty sure I have this. It's like a lip, um, it's basically like a chapstick that like is first of all really amazing. And it goes to like your lip color. This one's in your perfect pink. But yeah, basically it's clear-ish. We've already used it a little bit. And with like, I think it's probably like your lip temperature, it changes pinks. I don't really know how that works. And then we have this, which my mom has also claimed, the Bye Bye Lines Serum. Basically, it's just an anti-aging, wrinkle smoothing serum. The anti-aging armor, beauty fluid. I think it's like a colored anti-aging sunscreen. I think I might give that to Tori because she was talking about how she wanted something like that. I am very also excited for this, which is the Bye Bye Pores Primer. I found that my skin has actually become very oily. So this is like an oil-free primer that I am excited to try. And then they gave us three, or four, I'm sorry, I can't count, four different shades of the Bye Bye Under Eye Illumination Concealers, which I think these are new because I've never seen these before. I love the original waterproof ones. I think these are also waterproof. Yeah, they are. Um, but yeah, they gave us tan, medium, light, and deep. And I'm definitely gonna keep the light and the medium because winter and summer and then my mom really likes the tan and Tori's a little bit darker than both of us so hopefully maybe deep will fit her I don't really know and then also this brush which is so soft by the way this stuff smells like starburst it smells amazing um but yeah this brush is the heavenly skin cc skin perfecting brush it actually has like anti-aging qualities in the bristles which is crazy and it is so beautiful look at this so my almond milk is so beautiful um it is so soft and i have so many brushes though so i gave this to my mom um but yeah i love their brushes this handle is like everything oh my god but yeah that's everything thank you so much i love skincare and i love it cosmetics and i'm also love food i'm so excited to eat right now good morning everybody it's like 10 30 right now um been awake for a little bit, fed this one, even though she's begging for more food. And now I'm gonna make my coffee, which I technically already made. I'm just gonna put a hot chocolate mix in it because that makes it so good. Um, and then I'm gonna go downstairs into my room and work. I had like the worst sleep ever. It was terrible. There's, I just kept waking up and I had the weirdest dreams, and every time I went back to sleep, they would just like continue. And I don't know if that's a thing, if I'm like weird, but that happens to me a lot. Like if I wake up during a dream and I just think about it really hard, it comes back. Is that just not a thing? I'm gonna go downstairs and work a little bit, answer some emails. I woke up to like an absurd amount of emails that went to my phone crazy um so i'm gonna go work on those the fly is it like fly season because there are so many flies inside and outside my house right now it's gross so i'm gonna take my coffee my water and my phone and go downstairs what time it is it's target time i have to go to target again the irony of the fact that i haven't been to target in like a month and then i go this is my third time in like a row <sighs> is ridiculous i need to get a, no a new notebook because our water heater boiler thing broke like a couple weeks ago and my notebooks were on the floor in my room and somehow they got destroyed i didn't realize until i got to class so i need to go get only one of them really got destroyed the others are fine but um i need to go get a new notebook and i um, also have, I don't know if they'll have it, but I got this pearl necklace in Hawaii in April and it is so pretty. I love it. I've just never been able to wear it because nobody can get it on this clasp that it 
has that the chain has is so tiny nobody can undo it so i want to see if they have like a bigger clasp there and i'll attach it to that because i really want to wear it it is so bright out but yeah i'm gonna do that i'm gonna come back and make food because it is 5 30 and i have not eaten all day i've just i'm honestly just not hungry i don't know why but um i'm gonna come back and eat and i'm actually gonna film what i eat so i can upload a video today later today as well